Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm super pumped because today I'm going to give you all the tea on what is Chloe Ting and the two week shred challenge. So Chloe Ting, the two week shred challenge. Basically it's a two week shred challenge where you're supposed to get abs by the end of the two weeks. Obviously that is just like some people can get those abs. If you look like Chloe Ting, like, good for you. I'm super proud of you. I wish I looked like you. But all body shapes are different. Your weights are all different. Everyone's beautiful. And just because I did this to lose some weight and kind of get in shape to kick off my wedding diet doesn't mean that you need to lose any kind of weight. So disclaimer at the beginning of the video, I am going to share my results at the end. And if your results aren't the same or they're way better than mine, I still want to hear them. I want you guys to tell me all your results, share your results, but don't feel bad and definitely don't feel like you need to change your body just because it's something I was trying to do to get in shape for my wedding. I'm not trying to lose a bunch of weight or change anything about myself. I love my body. I love everything that I've been working hard towards, but I feel like it is something important to me to get in shape for my wedding. It's a big day for me, but also just to be in shape in general. I'm eating healthier and um, I am doing these two week shred challenge videos every single day for the past two weeks. So I did see some results, so stay tuned to the end and I will give you guys all the tea on Chloe Ting, what a normal day working out with these videos looks like, some tips along the way, and then my results. Here we go. So. Chloe Ting Challenge is a two week shred challenge and it's completely free, which is amazing. I have never seen a workout guide like hers where it has every day planned out for you with videos to watch on YouTube that are free. Um, it was amazing. I love having someone kind of tell me what to do in a structure that is not too hard where you don't want to do it every single day, but challenging where you're feeling like you don't have to go work out afterwards. So these videos are all I did for the past 14 days. So normally I would go to Orange Theory, I would go run, I would do a workout video, but for the past 14 days, I just did Chloe Ting every single day. The videos kind of range, which I'm going to show you from two videos a day to four videos a day, sometimes three videos. The best part about Chloe Ting is you only need 45 minutes max of your day to do these. So if you're in quarantine, great, you have all day, you can fit one of these in. If not, it's even better because I'm back at work now and I have 45 minutes after work to get this done and I think it's unreal the results i'm actually seeing real results from the videos and they're hard like i started it and i was like oh mountain climbers this is going to be so easy i never want to do mountain climbers in my life ever again they're so hard especially when you've been doing abs for 30 minutes and you feel like you're about to die so i think the videos are super challenging but super easy to get done in your day because you only need 45 minutes sometimes only 25 um, they're also fun if you do it with someone. So like I had a few friends doing the challenge at the same time as me. I would get Kyle to do some of the workouts with me every day and we could do it together. And even he was struggling. Like they're actually super hard and they make you sweat. So I wear my watch when I do them. How many calories I burn in an average of like two to four videos. And then at the very end of this video, I'm going to share some of my results. But like I said at the beginning, please take this with a grain of salt. Like everyone's different. Also, I mean, it's not like I had some great 11 line abs transformation. I just lost a little bit around my waist and did lose a few pounds. I feel healthier and that I could do abs way longer now than I could before. 45 minutes of abs and some cardio and everyday workout is way different than doing five minute abs at the end of your workout. So this will definitely kind of condition you to be ready to do abs full time if you want to do them every few days, every day after a workout. This is the video challenge for you. Okay, what's up guys? We are gonna go through what an average day would look like for me if I'm doing my Chloe Ting workouts, just so you can kind of get a feel of the video structure, what a video is like. I'm gonna show you a little bit of me actually doing it, and then the equipment I use and keep near me. Super simple, all you need is a mat, but I'm also gonna link below mine and my water jug just so you know exactly what I'm using every single day. So. Today I have four videos. Um, all four videos are structured. They tell you which ones to do on which day. So that's kind of cool. When you click the link to come to Chloe Ting, this is the page you're gonna land on. Two week shred challenge. And then it kind of tells you per day about 20 to 50 minutes. The longest is about 45 minutes. So with breaks in between, I guess about 50. And then for 14 days. So as you scroll down, this is how it's laid out. So day one, you do these two videos. Day two, you do these three videos. And then the longest you would do is day four. It also gives you in this corner, like how long that will take. So about 45 minutes, etc. So you kind of scroll down through here 
and uh, you'll see all the videos, all the different videos. And this is the one you do every single day. So this do this every day and then the abs in two weeks. So those are kind of your basis videos. I love this day because you get a little RE video in there. And anytime you click on these, it's gonna bring up the workout just like in a YouTube video. So there we go. Okay, so this is what my average setup looks like for these Chloe Ting videos. We are in my garage and I come out here every day. I leave my pink mat ready to go out here. I love this mat. It's like super squishy and lightweight, uh, doesn't slide. And then I have my iPad, my Hydro Jug, and my phone because normally I'm posting videos while I'm out here doing it to keep you guys updated. My iPad is where I play the video so you can use your phone or your computer, whatever you want to do. And then I also wear my Apple Watch just so I can keep track of my calories and my heart rate during these workouts. So definitely keep your water with you. I'm gonna link all of this stuff below so you can do the same thing as me. And let's kill this workout today. You can do this workout every day in a two weeks training program, we should find. So I did weigh in after my last Chloe Ting workout today and um, I lost a few pounds. I don't want to share beginning weight, end weight with you guys. And I heard about triggers and all this stuff. I'm not good at this stuff, but I did lose about six pounds in the past two weeks. I also changed my eating habits, so that is a factor. If you're not losing weight while you're doing it, that's okay. Um, I also took out a bunch of stuff from my diet, and I did lose about one and a half inches around my waist, so that's kind of cool just so you can see that progress. I didn't get like hardline abs, but stay tuned after this. I'm just going to leave the pictures of my before and after so you can see a little bit more of my actual transformation with these. Um, I love them. I mean, I a few things about Chloe Ting that I don't like are... She's ripped, so don't let that, like, look at her while you're doing it and be like, well, why don't I look like that? Like, you don't. It's okay. Everyone's bodies are different. If you do, amazing. If you don't, amazing. Who cares? You're doing it to try and be healthy and get fit, and that's what matters. Um, second thing is <laughs> music. By day, like, 12, you're like, oh, my God. This music, it's the same music every day, but it is nice because you can hear her talking. Uh, what I did some days is I was so used to the video format and what came next in the workout. I played my own music kind of in the background so I had Jonas Brothers going while I was doing Chloe Ting but I was still able to see the screen and kind of follow along. The workouts are very fast paced so you are keeping your heart rate up the whole time so something I recommend is if you wear an Apple Watch, a Fitbit, anything like that definitely wear it and keep track of those calories if that's something you're into, your heart rate and always keep your water next to you. I'm going to link my hydro jug below that I use because it's a full half gallon and it works miracles. I can drink it the whole day and then during my Chloe Ting challenge kind of like finish it off and I feel amazing. That's a, a little bit on the tea on Chloe Ting. Also some of my results. So you guys, I hope this is promising for you and this is something you want to try. I definitely recommend it. It's only two weeks. So just like put in the time, commit to it. You can do it. Um, I did it. So anyone can do it. And I'm going to link obviously all of this below the challenge link and uh, my outfits in this video of the workout. And Last but not least, here are my results. If I never have to do crossbody mountain climbers and up and down planks again, it'll be too soon.